Hey guys, this is Rush on my twenty three. Welcome back to another part of Get Out Alive. Still debating what to do here. Cause I found nothing. Absolutely nothing. Still need this key and the other key over there. There's a thing best down my freaking door. I feel so violated. Whatever. Alright, so I gotta think. Gotta find. Oh, okay. I'm so hungry! I know I'm complaining a lot, but jeez. You know, my boyfriend would actually get after me. Oh, you should. Oh, <gasps> books! I don't think she doesn't need these anymore. Is it or he or she? I don't know. Hello. Library back room key. Just gotta make sure everything is all nice and messy. Alright, so I guess the other ones are in the uh freaking okay. Over here. Sorry. Back to the place. Alright. Let's close this beh door, door behind us. Okay. Let's go to the rain hall, which is the this one over here. I am really nervous that that happens. Okay, here's the ring hall. Huh? Picked up oil, I'm gonna use that. Paper. Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. Okay. Martin Zyri. How long am I supposed to stay here? How long will I continue working for the goddamn Adrian? Why my father insisted on take me taking to take this job? I start to hate myself. Am I still human? Of course I can. They turn me into a monster. They say the torture deserve it. But how can a man do this to another? How can I do this to another? How can I how can someone just watch it without doing anything? Those people made mistakes, but at least they are still people, for God's sake. The only thing I like in here is a librarian. The only one with who I can normally talk. Oh, is he? Okay. He ended here the same way I did. Trapped in the middle of chaos, and no one of us can do anything about it. How Adrian chooses his personnel. And who are the people I'm killing? Today, I hug a man in the prison, cell 4, who was screaming and crying. I barely managed to attach the rope to the ceiling. Adrian told me to. The prisoner was suffering. I had to do it, and had to pull his face to the icy water. If I didn't, I'll be dead. And when I had to take the knife, rip his body, and leave him there, still a bit alive, 
still dying, I was thinking. Who is he? Or at least, who had he been? He was talking about his family, little children. But I had to do it to save my own life. Tomorrow I will continue my job in the net cell next. The man there was silent, didn't say a word. Just hold on, it will soon be it will be soon over for you. Alright, so this is kinda of reminds me of the um, original amnesia whenever can I have this? It kind of reminds me of the original amnesia of um, David, uh, not David, Daniel, uh, had to do all that stuff for um, Alexander, and it turned out that Alexander was tricking him. So I wonder why, I wonder if it's kind of, kind of the same thing, but it sounds like a freaking ultimatum. Know what I mean, guys? But yeah, I feel bad for the guy, actually. Look, another switch. Click. I don't see how that actually does anything, actually. <laughs> I don't know. Gotta look for more books, though, that I can take out of the shelf. This kind of reminds me of freaking Harry Potter, whenever, um the first movie that they had to take out the, um, like Harry, whenever, uh, yeah, my brain dead. whenever Harry had to go into the, uh, restricted section. Back whenever they were so cute. At least in my opinion. But it don't mind me of my useless ramblings. I am just here to entertain you people. Like, a good person. Alright, so we need to find... The librarian said, like, three switches, right? Should be in the freaking hall. Which I am wasting a lot of creamy oil. There was a grabbable book. Where is it at? It was a grabbable book! This is my imagination? Oh, right here. Okay, this is getting really pointless. Um. You're pretty. Shut up, you know, that's, uh. Uh, whatever they are. I don't even know what they are. Something that I can actually have to use. Bible. Sorry, God. Alright, that's two. Or three. Let me see here. Yeah. Four. So I found three already. So the other one has to be here somewhere. Right there. I see it. that there's nothing else here. Like more oil? So, what was the point of that again? I know, I'm making a mess, guys. Okay. Let me see your library's notes.
Okay. Well, where do I go? I flipped all the switches, right? So what did that open? I forgot what door it opened to. <sighs> okay, well I found the door. Progress. It's right there. Shit. Oh, St. Pat said, do I really have to go to the, um... I'm thinking, guys, I'm sorry. Do I have to go past the doorway that it just crashed? Hello! Ow! Out of the way! Hiding closet, that's what I was trying to do in the first place before it found me. <sighs> Ow. Alright, well, he's gone. I was close. That would kind of hurt. Good bodies. Alright, since he is out of the way, at least, I can check in here and see what's up. There's nothing there. Something's jammed. The door was freaking jammed! Of all things, whenever I needed freaking survival. Alright, let's see. Nothing? Nothing? Eh. Not you. Air. Well, he's gone now, so I don't really care about how much time that I take. Actually, I do care because I still have a lot to do. Oh, wait. Oh, here it is. The new type door leading to the offices were set up just ten days ago, and now as soon as Palbo incurred, they started to jam. We were trying to find a solution, but we were unsuccessful. However, we still think that the door can be opened by some proper tool that may provide the function of the pick lock. If the surgeons just borrowed the right tool, we could have made it. They are the only ones with such equipment. Then those crazy devils that are locked all the time in their room, experimenting with dead bodies. Wait a minute, that was the room that I was just in. That was the room that I was just in, too. Oops, sorry.
So, okay. So I locked themselves in the room. Okay, so it's in this room. So we're gonna look at a great nook and cranny here. Did I just go through that? I did not glitch the game, anybody. Everybody. Oh no! My friend! Oh no. What happened to you? What happened to you, buddy? Oh, I don't know. I just got stuck in here again. You left me at the Lord Legion or whatever the place was. Sorry, it wasn't my fault. Have you seen a key around? Somewhere around here. That's lovely. I don't want to be picking up dead buddies. Maybe I should check the other room. Yeah, I'm thinking of the same thing. Look at me, I'm talking to myself. That's great. Cause I don't see anything in the, in the beds. But there's another door over here. That was, um... Uh, yeah, over here. Well, that would've sucked if I used that laudanum. Didn't check these doors, though. See? Killing myself was completely worth it, guys. Now, don't do it in real life. If, if you do, then I'll be so mad at you. September 19th, 1877, our first exemplar of X human is finally complete. We just need the requested incredible amount of laudanum to start the process. The victims must be tortured to death first. But this one died of starvation three days ago. That's the specialty today. It's perfect timing. Process, excuse me. The process is complete. Still, there's no signs to change. Four hours, 20 minutes from the beginning of the experiment. Finally, something's happening. The body is moving. It's not. Nice view, but still, we made it! Oh, great. One day later, the again living victim is still moving and trying to break through the bars. So, like, it's like the stories for children with demons, but now literally. I am not so satisfied right now. The victim deserves rest. The rest is up in the closet. My, the rest up in the clouds. My god. A couple of hours ago. Oh, let me start. A couple of hours ago, the so-called demon made something that no one expected. He reached dead body and made something, and now there are two of them. What is going on? We should make some protection before they get through the weekend bars. Yeah. Um. You should know that wasn't the best idea you've ever had in your entire life. Okay, so those are the bars. Oh! Those were the monsters that I encountered. That would make sense. Still, I need a lockpick tool. Ah, uh, fudge. Is 
we couldn't be in through the weekend bars. I'm not gonna open that. Nope. Oh, it's just a rat. Hollow needle. What the heck? I'm out of here. What the heck was that? Some sort of uh, freaking. Oh, I'm bleeding quite badly. There we go. What the heck was that? Hmm. Alright, let's use this hollow needle. Click. Alright, here we are. Um. Yeah. Sorry. Uh, yeah. So, I'm gonna end this part here, the guys. So if you liked it, please leave a like and comment, and next time we shall go forth into more of this place that I really don't like to be at. <laughs> so take care, guys, and have a good day. See ya.